Earlier this year, the Queen expressed her wishes for Camilla to be known as Queen Consort when Prince Charles becomes King. In an earlier message that marked the 70th anniversary of her reign, the Queen said it was her sincere wish that the 74-year-old would be given that title. Speaking to Royally Us, royal expert and historian Richard Fitzwilliams discussed the Queen's wish for her daughter-in-law and how the pivotal move could stop tensions from forming. Speaking to Royally Us hosts Christina Garibaldi and Christine Ross, Mr. Fitzwilliams said, the Queen has expressed the wish that Camilla be Queen Consort when Charles ascends the throne. He notes that the Queen made the decision just before the Jubilee commenced. He added, it was absolutely pivotal because it is not terribly popular, never has been in polls, but people recognize that Charles and Camilla are a perfect match. The unhappy past is a long time ago but had that been left, you could have had the situation where it would have been announced, now obviously that was when Charles ascended the throne, but we know what follows thereafter immediately. Read more, Meghan and Harry caught in Netflix mess after master plan ruined by Palisades subsequent to that, in the months before the coronation, that could have resurfaced. He pointed through this decision, the Queen has done wonders. Charles and Camilla met for the first time in 1970. Three years later, Camilla married her first husband Andrew Parker Bowles. The couple later welcomed two children together. Read more, Im in good hands. Kate has royal fans melting with loving public tribute to William in 1980. Charles, then 31, began dating Diana Spencer, who was 18 at the time. Charles has previously dated her older sister, Lady Sarah Spencer. In 1981, just a year after they began dating, Charles proposes to Diana and the pair tied the knot later that year. During their turbulent marriage, the couple welcomed two sons. Prince William was born in 1982 and Prince Harry in 1984. According to Charles's authorized biography, he begins an affair with Camilla in 1986. Don't miss Meghan and Harry forced to back a procession to prevent photos, insight, William told how to approach Harry to avoid further embarrassment, analysis, Kate and William caught in photo battle with Meghan and Harry, video. During an interview with BBC One's Panorama in 1995, Diana spoke about Camilla's relationship with Charles. Diana stated, there were three of us in this marriage, so it was a bit crowded. Following their separation in 1992, Charles and Diana's divorce was finalized in 1996. Just one year after the divorce, the world was devastated to hear of the death of Diana, Princess of Wales in a fatal car crash in Paris on August 31, 1997. In 2005, eight years after Diana's tragic death, Charles and Camilla got married. On Monday, a photograph was released of the couple and the Queen to mark the annual order of the Garter Service. The 96-year-old DIDNT attend the event.